summer is coming to an end for students across the east. Most public school districts start back next week, but before they jump from the couch to the classroom, some students are getting an edge that's a cut above the rest. Our Brandon Truitt joins us now, and Brandon, this was a popular event today. Well, Angie Cops and Barbers is a community outreach program by the Greenville Police Department. In its third year, the back to school event draws kids into city barber shops. Pairing free haircuts and school supplies, students are brought face to face with the officers in their community. <laughs> For students in Pitt County, the last week of summer is buzzing with last minute fixes before the start of school. As you can see, uh, Full of kids, a lot of supplies going out. I mean, just a wonderful day. The third annual Cops and Barbers Back to School event puts kids in the chair and supplies in their hand, all while meeting the police who protect them. When kids actually get an opportunity to interact with cops, they get to see officers on a different level, as well as the officers get to see the kids and different people on another level, and it actually uh, make the relationship stronger. Eric Barnes is the owner of Young Vision Barbershop along Evans Street. Right. Barnes says he's seen the program grow from a one-stop shop to four barbershops across town taking part, all in an effort to make moments like these Look at this guy right here, man. Yeah, but he's How you doing, happen more often. Uh, for me as a police chief, uh, th this is one of our, our keystone projects. Greenville Police Chief Mark Holtzman says Cops and Barbers is paying off for the city. Now, we look at the barbershops as an opportunity to connect our police officers with the community. It's a great place to have a, just an honest conversation and it's a safe place. It's a comfortable place to talk. Officers serving free food right off the grill as students grab a new backpack, gearing up for a new school year. And their relationships over the years has even grown. More trust is even being built between the community and the officers. Young Vision Barbershop ran out of its supplies rather quickly today. Eric says they trimmed more than 50 heads of hair in the first hour and a half alone. The event just in time for many students in Greenville as classes for Pitt County schools start Monday. Brandon Truitt, not on your side.